is only a friendly. Let's hope we see the Blues actually go at United. The referee for this important occasion here at Windsor Park, Mr. Freddie McKnight from Guttenards. And quite a roar from this big crowd at Windsor gets us underway. And I wonder just what they can expect this evening. Are we going to get an exciting goals laden game? Or are Linfield going to play simply to keep the score down? We should be able to tell that very soon from the attitude of both teams. McElroy. Bertles and Koppel inside. Runs it out. Fraser with the throw in for Linfield, the longest serving player at Windsor Park, over 350 appearances. Rafferty. McCartney. Anderson. Little bit scrappy. Now here's a familiar figure to this ground, Nicker. Jordan Short to Wilkins. Great ball to McElroy. And all must have making the run, but that's a bad ball from McElroy. Nixon for Linfield. McCarry. McElroy wide. Oh, lovely ball from Will McCarry. Jordan and Rafferty back to clear for Linfield. McCarry on the near post. Jordan and Bertles at the far side. It's coming to Jordan. Well up Jordan. The way to Hayes to McCartney. Bit slow. Nickel. Now here's Davy Nixon. To Gary McCartney. Stephen McKee out here on the left. He's got Mark McGaffey ahead, ball inside, and a poor ball too. Lou McCarry. <laughs> Ian Wilkins couldn't decide which one to take it. side of the box, Joe Jordan following him, but that was a poor corner, Hayes for Linfield, and he's through, oh, oh, Magaki just passed the post, well that really is as close as we've come to a goal, and Mark Magaki, the man with the last, Linfield might play this game rather defensively, They've certainly been tight enough at the back, but they've, they've come forward in strength quite a few times and on a couple of occasions have caught this United defence out. Still no goals, though. Buck to Jordan and to Wilkins. 
Nice ball to McCarry. McElroy on the left. That's a good cross, and that must be in. Gary Bertles, the scorer for Manchester United, but it couldn't have been easier for him, really. And I must say, I think that goal comes slightly against the run of play. The cross coming in from Sammy McElroy. George Delop went down for it, grabbed it, couldn't quite hold on to it, and it couldn't have been easier. Jordan. And McElroy's clear. Bertles, Jordan, and Koppel in the middle. Here's Jordan. Koppel. Oh, and that should be a corner. sure if it was Joe Jordan or not, but he doesn't look too happy. And that is the half-time whistle from referee McKnight. Certainly a very entertaining first half. We've had plenty of action at both ends. As I've said, I'm not quite sure that United know what to do with the ball after... Well, it's hard to know exactly what Roy Coyle could have said to his players at half-time. They're certainly playing as well as I've seen them this season. And they have created chances against, let's face it, what's supposed to be a very good first division defence. As yet, they're lacking goals. And this team have won through this man, Bertels. Koppel. Wilkins. Terry Hayes played that well to Stephen McKee and he's been injured. To the action immediately. And there is Dornan shadowing Jordan already. Thomas. The linesman's flying. This a little contretop between Jordan and Dornan. Dornan must be on the field about 30 seconds. Well, it's certainly been a very clean match and there hasn't been any bother so far. That's the first sign. Well, whatever happened, and I didn't see it, it clearly was a, a foul by Dornan because the referee's given a free kick to Manchester United. Thomas is shot. Billy Murray for Linfield. To McKee. Drives Nixon back there. Parks. Fraser inside. No. And Linfield could be in trouble here. Four United players up against three Linfield defenders. What can they do? Couple. Couple trying to take it through in his own and foul. And that sums it up. Now he's got another chance. Nickel. Dorn and away for Linfield. Now Murray with plenty of room up front. Nixon. Good ball. McCurdy. Wonder if Linfield can manufacture an equaliser here. McCurdy with a shot and a poor one. Really wasted that chance, Colin McCurdy. has the whistle to his mouth and blows it. Well, there's Sammy McElroy. He'll be glad to get back into the first team tonight and should be well satisfied with his performance. 
I'm not sure overall, though, whether Manchester United can be all that pleased. They certainly had plenty of the ball and were forward most of the time, but once they got to that penalty area, well, they seemed to have very few ideas as to how to get the ball into the net. As it was, Gary Bertels got the only goal of the game. And for Lenfield, well, they certainly didn't disgrace themselves tonight. Indeed, far from it. They played very well indeed. Didn't let the Irish League down. Let's hope anyway that this uh, big 30,000 crowd have been satisfied with the action. I think overall they should be. And let's hope it's not 33 years again until Manchester United return to Belfast. From Windsor Park, good night.